Welcome to Film Series 5, I'm Shiv Mehta. Now, whether you're a seasoned director or just starting out, it's really important to direct your actors effectively. This determines, you know, the fate of your film, whether you're gonna get good performances or really bad ones. So let's dive into how to direct actors. When it comes to how to direct actors, it's really important that you and your actors have a good repertoire or a strong relationship between the two of you. Because no matter your experience as a director, for all the directors out there, I feel like it's very applicable, you need to be able to work. To, that means really understanding their routine and who they are as a person because you're gonna be spending a lot of time with them in rehearsals and on set. So it's really important that the both of you have a good relationship and are able to work together because film is a collaborative form of art. It doesn't work if you don't collaborate and don't know how to cooperate with each other. The actors need to have input because they're gonna be playing these characters. They're gonna be going in every day on and off set trying to think and trying to figure out who these characters are. And if the two of you can work together and have a good relationship and do all of that before you get onto set, you will have, you know, a pretty decent performance and product that you can, you know, share with other people and be proud of. The second thing when it comes to how to direct your actors, it's really important that you and your actor have a clear line of communication. If you're not able to communicate with each other very clearly, then you who's currently watching this film can forget about making your movie. Because movies are a collaborative form of art and they really depend on people being able to communicate with each other and being able to work together. Especially as directors when we're giving notes, we need to be able to tell the actors what we want without it being too confusing or too long or short. For example, you shouldn't tell your actors cry more intensely. When giving a note, you need to make sure that it not only addresses their character, but also addresses what emotional state they are in the beginning and the end of the scene and where they're supposed to be by the time the scene ends. And the third thing when it comes to, you know, how to direct your actors, it's really important to give them the space to just be able to act without too many directions and notes. Because the minute you overguide your actors and try to herd them around like sheep 24 seven, it can lead to them feeling insecure. And that insecurity can be felt by everybody who watches your film, which will make for a movie that people will notice is not very good in their eyes and might lead to something that you will not be proud of. And that's the most important thing is that you have to be proud of it and the actors have to be proud of it. So it's very important that we as directors learn how to step back sometimes and let the actors, you know, take control of the performance because at this point you've spent months with each other talking about the characters and where they're supposed to go. So by the time you get onto set and you're, you know, directing the scene, you should be able to trust your actors. And if you can't do that, if you can't like let go and trust other people, then maybe you shouldn't be a director. Maybe this is the wrong profession for you and maybe you need to choose something else. And yeah, that's how you direct actors. Thank you for watching this video. I'm Shiv Mehta and I hope these tips help you in your directing journey and help you make amazing movies and have wonderful experiences with your actors. Please be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and comment down below your thoughts and your processes when it comes to directing. What do you do when you're in a room with actors and what's your process? I'd love to hear that. And please be sure to subscribe for more film related content like this and to ring the bell to be notified whenever I upload, which is every third Friday. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.